Thanks for joining us. Donald Trump's pick for Secretary of Defense surprised many in Washington. In one Minnesota town, it's a point of pride. WCCO's Adam Duxter introduces us to Forest Lake's own Pete Hegseth. At the American Legion in Forest Lake, the weekly coffee for Bob Linwin and friends just got a lot more to talk about. I've been watching this pretty close, and and at the time I I wondered, but I didn't I didn't see that coming. One of their own, and member here, Pete Hegseth, chosen for Secretary of Defense. And it's a perfect fit. He's a younger man. He's a major, and he's knowledgeable, but he's knowledgeable in today's army, and I think that's. That's why he got chosen. Hexus roots in Forest Lake go deep, valedictorian in 99, and back home after a Princeton degree to serve in the National Guard and number of conservative veterans groups. He's got that, uh, that grit, that get to witness that's gonna, that's gonna serve him well. Legion manager Greg Weiss says it's a point of community pride. It's possible for anybody, you know, if so, and, and regardless of your political beliefs, if, if P can do it from Forest Lake, Anybody could do it, you know, and uh, you know, it's not the president elect, but it's it's right next to him in Washington. The reaction to choosing Hegseth, now a Fox News media pundit, a mix of shock and surprise. He does not seem to have much of a detailed background in DOD policy. The lack of experience is concerning. Linwood says he's confident Hegseth is the right pick. We've got a lot of things to change and we've got a lot of things to bring up to date. But I think he'll be up to the challenge. I really have confidence that uh, that he would. In Forest Lake, Adam Duxter, WCCO News. The Senate will still need to confirm Hegseth as Secretary of Defense.